the dumbest question you can ask a female comedian? The question like tell tell me a joke is like saying like show me your tits, but mm -hmm. like comedically. I'd rather just show my tits and then you're the conversation's over. Is tell it though? <laughs> <laughs> You killed it last night in your set. You How did you feel? It. <laughs> you killed it in your Thanks. set. We both killed it. My dad, he isn't a big fan of me being a comedian. He prefers the job I used to have. I used to be a high school teacher during the day. Yeah, thank you. The rest of you don't clap for education. That's great. No. It's too late. Fuck the kids, right? But don't. That's like the number one rule. Are there any topics or things you won't touch or are afraid to talk about on stage? I don't talk about my personal life that much. So mostly about stuff going on in the world. Yeah, and, okay. politics. My boyfriend recently made me go to a Bernie Sanders rally. It was either, yeah, yeah, it was either that or anal. And I just, <laughs> yeah, feel the burn, you know, either way, either way. Are you your total real self on stage? Or is there a bit of a persona of your real self? Um, I think the more I do it, the more I am who I am off stage. It's, it's in sit downs where I, I wear really shine. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like my persona on stage is sometimes a dumb drunk slut, which I think is fun, but I'm smart. I have a master's in teaching. I had a classroom and taught AP and they're like, oh. I think we got some Fan mail. It's really nice when you get um, fans actually taking the time to write you a letter. Because you know it's going to be something nice. Because you know it's going to be something nice. <laughs> yeah. You know? Okay, so I'll read yours. And I'll read yours. Read okay. <clears throat> oh, it says, I love you. Hey, hey, are you scared? It just kind of looks more like a ransom note. Oh, I know who that's from. It's uh, this weird uncle I have. He's oh. really working on expressing himself. But yes, I am scared to answer the question. <laughs> Dear Jenna and Kat, well, this is to both of us. How did they know we were together? <laughs> Who's your favorite dead comedian? Or if you don't have one, then near dead is fine too. Uh, I would have to say it's a tie between Joan Rivers and Bill Hicks. Joan is just so funny. Just so funny, and she came up in such a tough time, mm -hmm. and she just was so great at it. And I remember seeing her at I think it was like the Cornelia Street Cafe, and she was like in her late seventies and making nine eleven jokes and oh, like wow. edgy and yeah. funny. Yeah, she stood out so much just from her generation in general. Yeah. Like in addition to being a woman, I think she told one of the first abortion jokes on television. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I would say mine is probably like Lucille Ball. I mean, when it comes to like physical comedy, I feel like no one is better yeah. than her. She's so funny. Yeah. And again, she was also like she was the first person to be pregnant on TV. Like you couldn't even like say the word pregnant, and she was the first person. Oh, she was the first that. woman on camera to like be visibly pregnant. Okay, uh, this question is from Mark in Los Angeles. Are women funny? Well. Mark. <laughs> yeah. Clearly, if you're watching this interview, you don't think so. <laughs> uh, is that a question you've ever had to actually face? People do always ask, like, how hard is it to be a woman in comedy? And you're like, okay, like, it's hard to be a woman in any capacity. Yeah. You know, people at least listen to us. That's true. We at least have a microphone. We have a microphone. Yeah. And, like, I did get married. Five months ago. So uh, your husband writes all your jokes. Yeah, my husband writes all my jokes. <laughs> in fact, I have a, he's piping in right now in an earpiece <laughs> telling me what to say in this interview. What was that? Am I on my period? Yeah, he says I'm on my period. <laughs> that's, that sounds like a really healthy relationship. <laughs> yeah. Open one of my own? Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> That's not a good sign. The white powder, again. Oh. How thoughtful. We should just make sure it's not cocaine, just in case. <laughs> <laughs> do you think that they're going to enable the comments on this video? That's a good question. I do read the comments. Mm -hmm. um, I have a hypercritical mom, so it just feels like a hug. <laughs> come, come at me. Yeah. Haters on fun. YouTube 
really gives some great material to work with. <laughs>